Hello, and welcome to the Southeast Cornerstone Public School Division Edsby Parent Tutorial video. I'm going to help you navigate your new Edsby Parent account. This video will help familiarize yourself with the parent portal that Edsby provides, allowing you access to your children's class information, assessment progress, and attendance at any time. While Edsby has a mobile phone app that you can download through the Apple Store or Google Play Store, it can also be accessed through a mobile browser. But for the best experience, we recommend using Edsby on a computer or iPad with the Chrome browser. Families will need to create an account by following the link in the activation email and log in with their email and user created password. Note, this includes teachers who are also parents and guardians. They must use a personal email and not their school division email to access their students' information. If you have not received an email, please contact your school's main office. To log into Edsby on your mobile device, you are going to enter your server code. Your server code is going to be SECPSD. Um, press go. And that will bring you to the login page. Parents will have to enter their personal email address as the username, and then they will enter their password. Once you are logged into your account, you are going to see up at the top is the school's news feed. So this will have any information regarding what's going on at the school that the school has sent out. This is viewable to everybody, um, parents, students, and teachers. Under that, you are going to see your account settings. Um, to adjust your notifications, you can go in there if you need to ever log out or view recent activity or view uh, Edsby Help videos through the launch pad. Below that is your children. So in this case, Phyllis is the child, um, and I'm going to show you how to access the different pieces uh, there. First off, what we're going to do is we're going to navigate to the bottom of your screen and we're going to go into your messages. You are going to be able to see any messages between uh, the staff members at the school. So in this case, Mr. Christopher Lim is the teacher and you're going to see any information that uh, the teacher has sent. If you need to send a reply, you can send a reply and it just creates uh, a back and forth conversation with the student's teacher. In this case here, you also see up at the top, uh, it goes between Mr. Christopher Lim and uh, your child as well. Um, so in this case, Phyllis is also included in that conversation. You can also begin your new conversation by clicking the pencil. So for if you want to talk to another staff member, you can always enter in their name here. If we head back home by pressing the home button, um, we're gonna take a look at how to look at grades here. So to access your child's grades, you are gonna have to enter classes, and then you're gonna choose the class. So we're gonna look at science two. Up at the top of the screen, you are gonna notice my work. So you're gonna press on the my work, and here you see a list of assignments. So. I can click on the assignment. So if I click on this bottom one here, all about frogs, you are gonna see that there is a grade attached. So in this work, or this assignment here, Phyllis got an M or mastered. Um, you are able to see comments attached to it and discussion. So discussion uh, is between the student and the teacher, but it is viewable by the family as well. To view attendance, what the parent can do is they can enter the calendar view and they can select the date um, that they want to view attendance. In this case, this is a demo account. We don't have any attendance uh, placed for this student. 